Welcome to my channel. This is Crystal, your high priestess. Let's get into your bonus messages. What your past energy is for your partner want to tell you. Your current messages for what your partner want to tell you. What you don't see coming and the challenges for what your partner want to tell you. Let's see what's going on. This is a bonus reading for Pisces. Welcome to the Tarot Tribe. This is a Tarot Tribe reading. This is for the channel members. Okay, so let's see. Channel members. Let's go. All right, so your partner has the Ten of Swords. All right, so let me get that closer. So your partner is going through the Ten of Swords. Let's see. And a page of coins. They want to offer you an apology, Pisces. All right, let's see what else. And you have the Eight of Wands. So they might be sending you text messages. They might be trying to find an excuse to contact you. Okay. Um, so they do want to offer you something, but it might be too small for what you're looking for. But let's see. What is the current message? Is the Empress? Why does he is your beautiful? They see you very beautiful, Pisces. All right. So this is the Empress. Libra Taurus energy. Find you very attractive, very wise, come with wisdom, very nurturing. That's what they see about you. They also have the Seven of Cups. So they might have other options. I right, maybe not sure about this connection, maybe confused about why they're thinking about you, why they're feeling this way. They do have this two of pentacles, so they're juggling a decision. And let's see what the current, the future message is this for the partner want to tell you. Okay, so they're waiting for the right moment. All right. Um, right now, currently, they're in hermit mode. OK, maybe you guys are not on speaking terms. You guys are not communicating. And I also have this four of cups, rejection of four of cups. All right. So someone could have rejected a cup of love. You also have the three of wands. So they might be planning an, an, an escape. They might be planning a trip for you guys to go on. They want to speak the truth. And here's the ace of swords. And then you have the emperor. All right. So Aries. All right, this is an authority figure, a boss, someone who's very firm, very sure. So now this person wants to be honest about their feelings. And then you have this king of pentacles. Wow. And then you have this ace of cups, um, Pisces, a lot of stability and love this person wants to give you. And then you have this king of cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Very beautiful. Very, very beautiful. Now they want to open up emotionally. Now they want to offer you something stable. Okay, so I see a lot of honesty and love. Two new beginnings is your challenge. So the challenge for what the partner want to tell you is just being truthful and open up emotionally. This is very simple and cut and chase. All right, so we're going to clarify all of these cards because this person is really holding on to their pride and ego. Emperor, the emperor is an ego, ego. E e egotistical is what I wanted to say, but ego came out twice. So it might be several people you're dealing with where the ego got in the way. Um, I'm getting a concubine. Someone had all these options. They thought they wanted to be a concubine or they want, they were looking for concubines, but you were not playing that part. Okay. And if you don't know what that word is, please Google it. All right. So let's see what the past messages is. Let's clarify. Thank you for those who subscribe to my channel. I'm very, I'm very grateful for, the, for that. Why can't I freaking talk? All right. So let me get some... <laughs> I was going to say some water. I was clarifying the Ten of Swords, and the Ten of Swords came out twice. Okay. So this could be your partner um, feeling the Ten of Swords energy. Let me get my sage. Let me burn my inside. It was smelling so good in here. Okay, so welcome back, Pisces. Yes, let's get back into the reading. All right, so we got the Ten of Swords confirming the Ten of Swords. So your partner is going through the Ten of Swords. They either currently is going through that Ten of Swords or someone put them in the Ten of Swords after they left you. So let's see, why is the Page of Pentacles? The Nine of Wands. So someone was defensive and taking everything as an attack. Okay, well, they saying this about you. This is what the partner want to tell you. So, or maybe you hurt them, Pisces, with that Ten of Swords twice there. Eight of Wands here. Why is this here? Or they hurt you. So, put this story how you see fit. 
So someone finds you attractive, Pisces, Ace of Wands. They can't bear and see you having a spark with someone else. That's in their mind with that Ace of Wands there. They can't bear to see you. Air Z or Sag Energy. I'm dying. You also have a crazy B Gemini, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, as well as Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Literally everyone is here. So the energy is the passion was too strong, Pisces, and they don't want to let that go. Why is the inference here for the current messages? This person is seeking forgiveness, Libra energy, judgment, karma. Please forgive me for what I have done. Okay, now you can forgive or you don't have to forgive. Leave the comments below or just leave it behind. This is Taurus Libra. Forgive me for the past mistakes that I've caused. Why is the Seven of Cups here? Seven of Cups. Two of Pentacles and the Seven of Cups having options. A juggling energy here. Okay. And you have the Two of Pentacles, I'm noticing twice for the partner I want to tell you. So they think they had choices or they do have options. Okay. And you're serving ultimatums here. They don't have options, darlings. Because you're looking for a cup an ace of cup and the ace of swords the truth and if you're not juggling they're not juggling they don't have time to juggle anymore all right so let's see what else we got the seven of cups is here though so whatever the partner want to tell you they might feel like pisces you have options okay you're the one juggling i don't know leave me the comments below why is the seven of cups confused why are they confused and thinking pisces have all these options a knight of uh, cups, Pisces. Mm, maybe you do. Pisces, kiss and Scorpio. You might be saying, look, I have options too. You ain't the only one who can go out there and find. So, you know, all these kings in here, Pisces, you do got some options, darling. So this is the partner want to tell you. These are a whole bunch of people coming towards you. So you let them know you got options, okay? So this is hermit. Your person could be in the dark about something. Okay. Why is hermit for the partner want to tell Pice? The queen of wands, Aries Leo Sage. So to me, this could be another woman or you have an Aries Leo Sage who, who feels like they got time. They might be trying to strategic, strategically plan something, a way to get to you. Or this Aries Leo Sag or Virgo ghosted? Let me see. This is the partner want to tell you. They might find you attractive in the dark, but don't want to tell you because of rejection. Four of Cups here next. Let's see. Yeah, four, four. So the Four of Cups is rejecting the cup, and then you're unbothered. Someone is like, okay, you, you sleep good at night? Yeah, you sleep real good at night four swords so you're unbothered well this could have been them rejected your damn cup and now they're sitting here miserable four swords darlings okay so you see how you see fit this is the partner want to tell you so they could be miserable three of wands why is this here trying to figure out a plan to come get them ships honey yeah three of wands confirming the two of wands look at the ships the partner want to tell you they're planning. They come to get their ship, honey. So Pisces, buckle up. All right? Someone come to get their ship because they can't live without you. They cannot see again. They can't imagine someone sparking that fire that used to be theirs. Or this could be a new partner coming to you. See how you see fit. All right, Spirit is leading me to um, switch the deck. King of Wands. King, I mean, King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio is what the partner's challenge is. Opening up, speaking up about how they feel. Why is the King of Cups? So this is a new partner. Ooh, Pisces, they stuck on you in the tower here. Scorpio, Pisces energy. Okay. They're not trying to lose you, and they're not changing. The tower is, is change needed, 
okay? The hangman is stuck. So you stuck on someone or someone is stuck on you? Leave the comments below. You do have a new love coming towards you. Who is this king of pentacles? Seven of wands, protecting the family. Aries, Leo, Sash, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. This is someone who's who's very strong. And they're going to stick by you through thick and thin, Pisces. All right? So that's that could be an Aries, Leo, Sash, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Why is this big Ace of Cups here for the challenge? You got the Chariot and the King of Pentacles, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Cancer. You have this King of Pentacles twice, stability. So the partners, what I'm getting, Pisces, want to tell you is that they changed. Okay, and they want to move towards you. Chariot is a fast moving energy. I'm coming to get my Pisces. I don't care what Pisces are saying or doing. I don't care who Pisces is in love with. If Pisces think they're going to have a new beginning with someone else over my dead body, come hell or high water is what I'm getting. So let's get into the Ace of Swords. This is a really good reading, Pisces, for the partner I want to tell you. Beautiful. Let's see. I want the truth. Ace of Swords. Justice Libra here. So someone is afraid of some type of rejection. You won't believe them. Um, you might question them or you are questioning them. All right. You're saying you're you're not saying that you don't believe. You're saying I want tangible evidence. I want to see change. I don't want to have to force the change. All right. So you want some truth about what happened. Why did you do what you do? Why why did you why did this happen? Happen. Or you could have someone new Pisces that they're saying to you, don't judge me. Don't falsely accuse me of things that happened in your past. That's your past. I'm your future. All right. So you got emperor, Aries energy, a supervisor, a boss, someone who's financially stable, but very stubborn as well. Why is the emperor here, Aries? You have the world, the emperor, and the four voices. So this could be someone in the distance. And then you have emperance with the emperor. It's a mother, father figure. Someone is coming with mother issues, mama issues, or daddy issues. And if it's not mother issues or daddy issues, this person sees you as a divine feminine. Because you got the divine masculine, this emperor is next to it. Aries, these are a couple. This is the maker of life. Okay? They have children together. They live together. They have bliss. Very firm um, foundation. And it comes with stability. So this person could be thinking about the right time to come forward. Four swords, maybe they need more time. But I'm not sure, Pisces, if you have, if you're waiting. Again, I'm seeing some Pisces are in a connection and a person come out of nowhere. And you're like, what? All of these people come out of nowhere. And you're confused. You don't know what to do. Let's see what the advice is for what you should do. Well, this is the sun. And this is that independent love. Continue to work. Focus on work. Someone is having a child. That's the emperor and the emperor again. Mother, father figure. Or again, someone has mother, father issues. So someone needs to end the connection with their baby mother, baby father. You know, three's a crowd. All right? You're not interested in polyamorous relationships. All right? So I'm going to leave it at that. This is definitely uh, your advice, Pisces, is to really... Uh, dig in a person's past and figure out what it is that they want. Okay. And if they don't show you through actions, remain single, make yourself happy, go on that vacation. You don't need company. This is Leo as well as Virgo. And then I see Taurus Libra. All right. You also have Cancer, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, a crazy bitch. I'm not, everyone is here. Let's see what type of jobs these people have for the partner I want to tell you. They might also be telling you that they're single. Nine of Pentacles is a single card. And with the sun and the emperor twice, this could be a birth of a child, a little boy. Let's see. What type of jobs these people have for Pisces? 
I see a driver. You have the musician, a revolutionist. Someone's betrayal. We got that earlier and the lawyer. Hopefully this is not a divorce or separation. Keeper of justice, law, cases, defense, and advisor. Deceit, disloyalty, uh, conspiracy, broken bonds. Revolutionist, champion of transformation, freedom fighter, pursuer of welfare and justice. A, mus a musician, a composer of harmony, creation, passion, soulful sound and celebration so it could be a dj they like listening to music i don't know pisces so you know your story better than i do um i'm gonna leave it at that as your bonus it was a very beautiful reading and you have a lot of options here um or a lot of suitors and all these people are coming back from the woodworks and they are offering you love commitment and uh, stability here so I see some of us might not want to respond with this four swords twice. Very beautiful reading Pisces though. I see a birth of a child. Let's get one more for Pisces. All right, so I'm seeing conflict, coming out of conflict and the 10 of cups, not wanting to fight. This person might be afraid to come forward because they don't want to get in a fight with you. Is what I'm gathering. So you have different situations here. The person might want to come back to express their love for you, but they don't want to fight. Maybe because you're too hurt, maybe you want answers. You want to figure out what's going on. All right? That's what the partner want to tell you. I want, don't fight with me. I love you. I miss you and I love you and I don't want to fight. I'm going to leave it at that, Pisces. Namaste.